Let's try the workflow with Excel. And first, let's open the file, our folder 9, Excel, and let's try this one, NWC file. Okay. And in first, I would like to have my own database from the elements what I really need. I need the elements like mechanical equipment, and I want to add them maybe some special properties from catalogs from the manufacturer or to get special statuses like on-site or constructed on other, other things. And first let's, let's take it. Selection tree, properties, then go to element and I want only mechanical equipment. So category and mechanical equipment. Okay. And let's make the database. We only want, only need to press selection inspector, this one. And now I want to quick property definitions to delete some some things. Okay. And about this one, the volume. Oh, it's okay. And now I have. This list, and I can export it to the common separated value file, and let's uh, let's export it to this file, to this folder, nine Excel database, second one, save it. Okay, want to replace it, and now we've already done our new database, and let's open it. Let's open it from this file, the common separated value file. And in first, let's do some new thing. Oh, okay, this two we don't need. Let's delete it. And let's delete the name. Delete it. And insert the new one because it were name of two lines. And we know we need the name of one line. The name and the ID. Or whatever you want to make a link between this tab and uh, this spreadsheet and the model element in Navisworks. Okay. In next videos we are going to make a link between them.